let's try this again. The other day that live got messed up because the connection kept crapping out. So I said I'd do one today and I am. Now I'm gonna hold the phone because I got a lot of complaints that the machine was making too much noise you couldn't hear very well. You would think I'd understand this shit by now, but what you gonna do? Cheek check. Cheek check. Fred Brick saw hello. Little Bo Peep. <laughs> How hot is it in Florida today? I don't know. I didn't check the temperature. It's like 90. Last time I saw Jason was a while ago. But I see called me last week. He's doing good. Some people have to go to work, that's right. Yeah, I was saying in the last one, I got, they changed our start time to nine o'clock, so actually gives me a little more time to train, sleep. It's nice. Good morning, big head. <laughs> thousand million years sleepy fish Jason's living with his mama you getting in shape for anything specific <laughs> yeah so I don't fucking die early I think PJ Braun is giving or receiving I don't think either he's in a federal prison he's he should be fine. I'm sure he's making a lot of friends. And he's, he's the non-violent offenders. He's, my God, he's getting butt fucked. He's seriously. I train for three to four days a week and now I'm gonna do, I, I'm gonna lift three days and then do cardio too. So, which is what I've been doing actually. But I also said in my life, I got a new route, which doesn't require a lot of walking anymore. It went from five miles a day to two miles, so that's why I'm out here doing this. Otherwise, I wouldn't, because my the route that I had, I was walking five miles a day in the heat, so I didn't really need to do cardio. But now I can tell. I can feel it. It's new, Jason. 20 years of pub Publix. Andrew, I speak to Andrew every now and then. He's doing good. Lenny's fine. Go look at Lenny's YouTube channel. He does a live every night. They're better when he's not at home because he's got to kind of censor himself when he's sitting at mommy's house because she's listening. So when he's out and about is when his lives are better. I saw... <laughs> oh, the other day, he took everybody into the, the shitter at Publix and blast it off, which is fucking hysterical. He's more himself when he's not at mommy's house. He seems a little more subdued at home. But I liked, one of the last lives he did, it was short. He was talking about Jay's little challenge that he had and he was spot on correct. What the hell's the point? Oh, Jay. Challenge some, challenge, you know, someone that's not knocking on death's door and the other one, you know, why, why McLeod? He said he has the worst genetics. What's that gonna get you if you win? The real, uh, the Big Lenny show is his YouTube. He does a live I, almost every day. Why would Lenny fight JT? We're too old for that shit, dude. You're either gonna get hurt, go to jail, or both. It's just, it's stupid. Russell Crowe, I know, right? I saw this shirt Jay made and said I would never make a yellow shirt 
first of all, the shirts that we did make, the bedroom bully shirts, didn't sell that much. You can ask Andrew. He can ask Andrew if he wants to verify that. And that maize color, I don't think they could get the exact maize color. I didn't want yellow, so. I don't even actually remember exactly what happened with that. That shirt's hardly sold. People, you know, that's a funny shirt, but wearing it out in public, how many people are going to do that? Yeah, Andrew would get the orders off the website, and then he would just send it, you know, send it over to me, and I would ship them. 3.5 is what I'm walking at. Where did I sell myself in four years? Where do you see any? I have no idea. That's a good question. Uh, 260. <laughs> 260. Yeah, right. If I was 260, forget it. I fluctuate between 195 and 205. Right now, I'm probably... I don't know. I, don't, I haven't weighed myself. All my clothes still fit the same. I've worn the same size for 20 years, so... Once the belt... Once the shorts start getting tight and the shirts start getting tight, that means... Ask Taco Queen for permission to do a gym video. I don't need to ask her permission. You could do one anytime. Lenny just has to... Well, Lenny always says I have to reach out to him. Listen. We text. We don't really talk on the phone much. But I've called him. He doesn't answer. He'll call me back, though. But he never reaches out to me. If he wants to do something, he can. We could set it up. But it's for his channel. It's for him. He needs to, you know, he needs to put forth more of a fucking effort, okay? It doesn't do shit for me. isn't putting up with some bloated booze bag. <laughs> you probably won't believe it. I haven't drank since the Sunday before last, so you can throw that theory out the window. I've been eating good, though, I'll tell you that. I don't drink as much as you guys think, but let Lenny paint that picture for you guys. Did I fuck change? <laughs> no, fuck. And fuck her with your dick. I know, man. I am grizzly. I haven't had a haircut in over two months. That shit, the you know, I usually I cut my hair once a month, and I make I have her do it real short, so I don't have to go all the time. So I only have to go once a month. I'm not one of these fruits that has to get there. They gotta get lined up every goddamn week, please. This is shit anyway. I'm not a fucking model. What the fuck is this shit? Shout out to Glasgow. That's in Scotland. My uncle went to Scotland once. They said they never, he didn't see one attractive woman. He said they all look like basset hounds. I'm sure that's not true, but. No, Rob's not at Aces anymore. I should go down and see Rob, actually. Maybe I will. I'll reach out to him. He's at a new place. No, I don't watch rugby. I actually had a friend in Vegas that went to UNLV when we lived there. He played on the rugby team. They had some great fucking parties. Those boys know how to party. Do you remember when Jason was going to be a model? <laughs> hey, Shuey, what's up? I heard it's very hot over there. Welcome to our fucking world. Andrew is back. Andrew sees Jay at the gym, I think, once or twice a week. And he'll film little skits for him until Jay gets back on the road. Did your pec fully heal or... Yeah, it fully healed, but some once in a while I'll feel a little soreness in that area. Right on, it's on the side. So I just I don't do any ego lifting anymore. 225 is the most I go on anything, except for back. But if I do rack pulls or deadlifts with the trap bar, I go heavier than that. Otherwise, squats no more than 225, bench no more than 225. 
If I can't get at least six reps or something, I'm not doing it. That's not. Once they hit 40, it's all these little nagging injuries and shit start happening. So, to me, it's not worth it. If I'll be 44 in November, what's a bag of cucumbers? <laughs> Bunch of cucumbers in a bag. That's one phrase that I cannot stand. People saying, bag of dicks. Look a bag of dicks. That's so fucked up. I'm up with something else. I know, I gotta train these calves too. That's right, it's not worth injuring yourself. You can get good pumps with lighter weight. Hey, listen. When I went and trained with Dale and Cornelius, they weren't doing any kind of heavy fucking weight, and they look great. But you, they already got that base. If you already have the base, you don't need to. Do you stuff for your rotate? Do you do stuff for your rotated cuffs? I guess I do shoulders once a week. Is it possible to deadlift heavy without hurting yourself? Sure. Dude, don't ask me. Your, your, your handle is big gym power lifter. You should know more about that than I do. I'm not a bodybuilder, I'm not a power lifter. I just. Weight. I just lift weights. I like lifting weights in the gym. I don't need to. feel good I tell you what since I started I train in the mornings and in, in the summer because it's just at the end of the day it's I'm too exhausted but training in the morning I'm hungry all fucking day you could eat all day bring back to my shits <laughs> listen Jay's got his own channel Lenny's got his own channel I have this Instagram bullshit. That's what you're gonna get. The podcast, yeah, fortunately that's done. Nobody really, if we wanted to do it, we would. Nobody wants to do it, so who cares? Except for maybe Lenny, because he's got nothing else going on. Hack squats and light front squats instead of back squats. Yeah, I got this hack squat here. I like it a lot. No, I don't have air conditioning in this part of the garage. Cats or dogs? Dogs. I don't mind cats. Cats are actually easier to take care of. How many times per week do you work each body part? Once. I'll do chest and buys, push pull, back tries, shoulders one day, legs one day, or do shoulders and legs all one day. Just depends how much time I have. But the last time I did legs, because I usually do legs first and then I'll hit shoulders, I, I went over my time limit. I didn't have time to do shoulders, so then the next day I just hit shoulders. You are Hennessy, no, I don't drink Hennessy. I have before, I don't, I don't know. So the podcast at your house won't happen. <laughs> How can a podcast here happen? Nobody, everybody lives, Lenny's about 30 minutes from here. I'm 30, 40 minutes. Andrew's 45, 50 minutes. They're not driving up here to do a podcast. If they wanted to, I'd do it. Nail prickening. Hey, Lenny's alive. I just said go to his channel, The Big Lenny Show on YouTube. Me and Taco Queen met at a church. The Zoom thing isn't that hard to do. You don't even need to meet up. Come on. I don't know how to do the Zoom. And Zoom sucks. That 
Toast podcasts over video, they stink because there's a lag. You end up interrupting each other. I don't, I don't like doing it that way. I'd rather be in person. I not, and and I think everybody else feels the same. What's in those cheeks, Brad? What's in these cheeks? That's a good question. I'd pay to see Lenny's cat Onyx go toe-to-toe with Ninja. I wouldn't. Onyx would probably fuck her up. Cats? Especially outside cats like that? They're scrappy. They'll fuck a house dog up. Or if she gets her jaws around its neck, forget it. I don't hear from Chuck, Emma, or Mike, no. Emma I did a little while ago. I guess her ex-boyfriend was hacking all her shit. What a stupid program. Do PPL. What's that? Enlighten me, expert. New York knicker. Is Nate still being careful? Yeah, he is. This would suck some sweat. Fucking burned your eyeballs. I saw Nate a couple weeks ago. He's doing well. You guys are ruthless on his way. And his new woman. It's not nice. Again, you act like Nate's a fucking supermodel. Jesus Christ. And he said you hang with a tough crowd. No, I don't. And he's a fucking idiot. Master on? No, I never did master on. I heard it. You lose your hair when you're on that shit. two lives in a week well the other one I deleted because it sucked because it kept glitching so I said I would do one today and I actually stuck by my word this time well I said maybe I always got to put maybe in there because you never know I don't want to you know get your hook the worst thing about the maniacs that we have if you say something and you don't do it you get Relentlessly trolled. So. You don't make promises. Does a taco queen train? Yeah, she does. She trains here and she's got a gym membership. She try to do a podcast every two or three months. Nah, for what? Two or three. For, if we were to do a podcast, you got to do at least one a week. No, you're not coming on this live stream if I don't know you. Conrad, no offense. You have gym equipment at home. What are you, a fucking... <laughs> no. Actually, Aladdin was nice enough to donate most of it. And no, for somebody who thinks that Aladdin would be pissed that we don't film here, he doesn't give a shit. I speak to... A, I communicate with Aladdin. I should say communicate because it's over text. With Aladdin more than Lenny does. And he's happy for everybody. He doesn't give a shit. What happened with PJ's in prison for 50 months or something? He shouldn't do that much time. When are you eligible for retirement? When I'm 56. Which is 12 and a half years. I mean, I could go earlier, but you want to go to your full. So you can maintain the medical benefits. Jason is better off without the YouTube channel. He's very, he gets along with his mother now. He's out of the drama. I know he's bored though. He's definitely bored, but he doesn't need the aggravation. Oh, I'm way behind, sorry. Yeah, man, it's hot as fuck in here. I've been going for 25 minutes so far. I'm gonna ride the bike. I got another 20 to go. Are your ears shrinking? No, my head's getting fatter and 
Valerie had to let me know that I was that I hold the camera at the worst possible angle, which I don't give a shit. I don't care. You don't care. Like I said, I'm not a model. Okay? I don't give a fuck. I hold the camera wherever I want. If it makes me look fat and ugly, I don't care. Reunion gym video, okay. That'll be so exciting. Fifty six must be a mailman special, yeah. The way it goes is you gotta have the years plus your age have to equal eighty or eighty five, I think. Here's a better, better angle. You get to look at my fucking six head. I'd love to see what some of you look like. Oh my god. Good morning, Tally Whacker. You share which PEDs you've experimented with. I'm looking to gain strength. Don't ask me. Go to CDCon1. Go ask Cornelius. He'll tell you. So Cornelius is a straight shooter. He knows his shit. I would advise anybody for workout, supplement, all that shit, go to him. Brad got that permanent squeeze the nose look. I don't know what that means. Oh, squeeze your nose and push out your cheeks. You love my cheeks. You love to lick my other cheeks, you little homo. Speaking of homos, I've seen some rappers lately that have fucking fingernail polish. What in the fuck is that? What the hell is going on, man? I mean, I guess it's just... Stupid trends. Just like... I mean, we listen to 80s hair bands that wore fucking makeup, so... I guess I can't say shit about it. No, I'm not riding a unicycle. I don't meet with one of you, Andrew. No, no, we just speak over the phone. Last time I saw Andrew was when I got those letters from Delray Fitness that are still sitting in the garage. I gotta clean them. There's a lot of fucking, I don't wanna sound like paranoid Robzilla, but there's black mold in there. Yeah, Jason deleted his YouTube channel. Transform X nicked all the content before he did though, so he reposts a lot of shit with a little editing. It's not bad. Reunion video, no. Not that I know of. Look, I'm not the I I don't call all the shots. I don't know why you guys think it's Lenny has to send everybody to Oh Ash Brad, go DM Brad. I'm not the one with the YouTube channel, buddy. What's the body count of the Delray Ripper AK Princess? Thousands. Yeah, Jason's all social media, except for Facebook. Jason Blaha, I don't watch any of his stuff. I, I've seen, I know, yeah, obviously, I've seen some of his stuff. I agree with some of the st stuff he said about bodybuilding, how it's a death cult. Bodybuilding is just to see who, who can do the most drugs and get the biggest without fucking dying. You gotta have great genetics though too. I wouldn't even call it a sport. The family's great, everyone's good. My son's about to go back up to college in a few weeks. He's been down here working all the time, which is good. He couldn't play summer ball because he, what the fuck did he tear? Tore his UCL on his elbow. He had to have a cast on for a few weeks, but he's better now. He healed up nice. 
Yeah, I know. Jason's little award. They spelt his fucking name wrong. That goes for the that figures. I do a powerlifting now. Not, no interest in that. <laughs> you guys are sick. Did your son have some time alone with Stephon? <laughs> You've been on Pornhub too much. Looking at stepmom porn, you sick freak. Yeah, we've seen alligator on the road. Not many though. They know where they shouldn't go. Mainly on golf courses, I'll see alligators. There's a lot of those fucking iguanas around. I don't see too many out here, but. Canals and shit. Shows to, you gotta watch the terminal list with Chris Pratt is a great show. Although they don't like him because he's a conservative Bible thumper, but he's a good actor and that show is excellent. I don't know how Brother Pajama is. DM uh, Guy's sister Nino. I used to golf. I haven't swung a club in over four years since I fucking pulled my shoulder. But I can play now if I want. I should start up again. I could play for nothing at some really nice courses, so I probably should. But I get off now at fucking 5.30, which sucks. If I get off 5.30 and straight to the course, I probably could get in nine holes before it gets dark, but... Andrew's doing very well. Any more tattoos? No, I'm looking at, I'm gonna remove all of them. Lenny sent me a, a good place to go to get them all removed, just for Lenny. But no, actually I don't have any tattoos planned. How do you stop watching porn 10 times a day? Stop. I don't know what to tell you. Porn's good for learning, research purposes. I'm not removing her. I'm being a smart ass. I know Len you can clip that and send it to Lenny. He'll get it might actually get his dick hard. Nothing else does. He's very obsessed with me, I don't know why. I know he's got gay feelings for me, but that's all right. Let Lenny conduct his Bible studies there with Sassy Savage guy. I don't know what his obsession with that chick is. Less bloated than before, less bloated than two days ago. <laughs> Not running shit. I eat and drink what I want. I don't drink a lot of alcohol, as everybody thinks. Would you rather live in Tampa or Fort Lauderdale? Oh, neither. But probably Fort Lauderdale because I'm more familiar with the area. Tampa, I don't really know much about, except that I know McCuck lived there and he said the traffic was horrendous. But the traffic's horrendous in Fort Lauderdale, too. What are your decline benching these days? I said earlier, I don't go more than 225 for reps. Don't need to, you get a great fucking pump. I don't wanna get any bigger. I could use some toning, obviously, but other than that, I don't want to go buy all new clothes. That's a pain in the ass. There's no plans for a podcast, no. If those guys want to do one, you have my number. Yeah, I'm in West Palm Beach. 
actually west West Palm Beach, the acreage, Loxahatchee area. Moving from New Hampshire to Florida. I like New Hampshire. My grandparents had a house that go in the summers is called Ossipi by Lake Winnipesaukee. Most people can't say that. It was a great house. There's actually Grover Cleveland's fishing camp that my grandfather had bought. It was beautiful, I wish they never sold it. The dogs are great, getting big. Well, Ninja, she's not, she's getting a little bit wider, but Butcher's almost done growing. He's gonna be two next month. She's gonna be three. New Hampshire's ice cold garbage. Yeah, I bet in the winter. But in the summer, it's beautiful. What's your favorite stack? Test and trend. Oof. That's a good one. Have you been helping Ian McThay fund his? No. Ian's on the spectrum, I think. And I think a lot of that shit is a fucking act. I don't buy it. Who the hell? You spent all this time filming videos. Go. There's millions of jobs, dude. Go get a job. Get off this shit. Get your mind right. New Hampshire's cold in the summer. It's 62 right now. Holy shit. It's only 92 in here. All right, I'm about to finish up. Get your... I should do this later in the afternoon. When... There's more sick trolls on there. Cruise on test, yeah. The next episode of Better Call Saul's titled Breaking Bad. The last episode I saw was when he, you know, this, his wife left him and then he got, I thought the last episode was the last episode. That's a good show. Breaking Bad is a great show too. Do I prefer weed or shrooms? I don't know, they're both great. New York Knicker, why don't you come find out? Is missionary your favorite position? Jesus Christ. No trolls are in the morning because none of them work. <laughs> Frank gas station. Where's the gas station? New York Necker, I'm missing no spoilers, Brad. Yeah, I watched The Boys. That's a great show. Excellent show. That's what we named the dog after, Butcher. Brad, this big cheek's making my doodle hard. Oh, I bet. Thanks for spoiling Better Call Saul. It's a prequel to Breaking Bad. You already know what's going to go on there. Yeah, Jason's still too cardinal in the Publix. Adios. Yeah, it's time for me to go to Maniacs. Have a wonderful day. Not like Lenny says. Say your prayers, eat your vitamins, eat, sleep, and grow.